Hello everybody, Michael here from Anchored Tech, and today we are going to do a little comparison between the original Apple Watch and the new Apple Watch Series 2 processor, which is supposed to be way faster, way better all around. And um, this is the two watches booting up. Um, it takes a while, so I'm going to speed this part up, and I'll be right back to you when it is over. And it, it, takes, it takes a while, even on the new one. Gotta speed that up, Apple. So as you can see, uh, the Series 1 is a bit slower than the new Apple Watch. And I'm trying to click music, I just messed up. But as you can see, it was pretty fast on the new watch, and the old one just, it took it took a while, it took a while. So next we will go to the um, timer app, as you can see, loads really fast on the new watch. And this is just overall fluidity, look at, look at the screen. Look at the screen as I drag it on this watch and then the other watch. Look how laggy the other one is. And those apps loading, they aren't loading. Um, they're stuck like that. I don't know what's wrong, but look at this Breathe app. It already loads the background in the Series 2. And the Series 1 just takes a lot, a, a lot longer. And these are the stock apps, so they're going to be faster than any third-party apps. Home, as you can see, already loaded up. So this is just a normal occurrence with all these watches. They will just be so much faster as phone. You can call someone. 10 times faster, not 10 times, but you, you, you get what I say, you get what I mean. But camera, you can load up the camera. It, it, that one's pretty close though, I'll give them that. But overall, just fluidity and everything just seems so much smoother on the new watch. And this processor has really helped Apple gain some like goodness in the watch. And look at, as I force touch, look at this. Look at the lag on the old watch. And as I switch, there's not much lag, but the old watch, honestly, you, you, you can tell that they did not put the correct amount of processing power in this watch. And that's about it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, and if there is anything else Apple Watch related you want to see, leave it in the comments below. And it would really help me if you hit like on this video if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.